Brandon Cook appeared in court today, presumably for the last time in connection with this road rage case. Last week, Brandon Cook was found, he was acquitted of involuntary manslaughter in the death of 60-year-old Orlando Fernandez, but found guilty of a lesser charge of battery. The two got into a fight last August on the side of U.S. 30. Fernandez suffered a heart attack and died. The jury deliberated for almost five hours before reaching that split decision. Today, the prosecutor asked the judge to sentence Cook to one year in jail, which is the maximum. The prosecution pointed out Cook's prior criminal history, including domestic battery, disorderly conduct, and a DUI. When given the opportunity, Cook declined to address the court today, and no family or friends of Cook or Fernandez appeared in the gallery or testified. The judge sentenced Cook to one year in jail. However, Cook has already served more than the minimum time required. As a result, he will be released from Allen County Jail sometime today. Reporting live in the newsroom, Angelica Robinson, Wayne 15 News.